Hi, welcome to Take a Breath and Pause. I'm Tessa, and this here is Murdoch, who you can't see. Um, today we're going to be talking about puppy health and hygiene, or, or dog health and hygiene. Um, it's really important to keep your dog healthy, and what this this looks like is pretty simple and straightforward. Um, you should get a good vet early on. You might want to get on pet insurance. I think it's a little bit of a scam, but Murdoch just got diagnosed with cancer and I really wish that I was on pet insurance right now to cover some of those costs. Um, I always told everyone it was a scam before that, but currently I'm really wishing we were on it. Um, it's also very, very important um, to brush your pet's teeth. Mouth hygiene is huge. If you, there are studies that show if you brush your dog's teeth, it can increase their lifespan by up to three years. Uh, it's miserable. I try to do it while I play tug so that he's distracted and I just like stick it in. I don't use toothbrush, I just use that, that tooth, an old toothpaste. I don't use toothpaste, but I use an old toothbrush to just make that motion happen. Um, and um, yeah, so I'd say that's one of the most important things. Um, food is another really important thing. Get your dog on a good diet. Get the more expensive food. I use science diet. I also sometimes make him food when he's like, his stomach is off or something. I use sweet potatoes. Um, I use eggs. I use a little chicken, making sure there's no bones in there, a little rice to help with that. And um, yeah, just trying to use high quality food. I know it's expensive, I know it's hard, but it will save you costs down the road. Um, the other thing is I would not bathe your dog a lot. Um, they have very natural oils that can that help with health. If you bathe your dog a lot, uh, that will, will actually cause more problems. I never bathe my dog because he hates it, but I do once or twice a year use waterless foaming dry shampoo. Um, but only once or twice a year, max. Um, or if they get into something super stinky, that's okay too. Uh, the other thing is brushing. Brushing can really help with uh, skin conditions, hair conditions, um, and, and reduce shedding as well. Um, and also, cutting their nails, uh, it's probably good, not super essential. I don't do it a ton. Um, but it, it can it can be useful. So those are the things I would say are the most important for health and hygiene. Get them exercise, give them lots of love and attention, feed them good food, brush their teeth, um, make sure they have water, access to water all the time. If it's hot, be aware of that. If it's cold, be aware of that. Um, if their paws are cracking, put a little salve on that, like unpetroleum jelly is fine. Don't use Vaseline though. Uh, don't you, don't give them pain pills. Go to the doc, to the, the vet for that. You know, giving a dog ibuprofen can cause problems. Um, always check in with your vet. I'm not a vet. Um, I'm just giving some basic ideas that I use. Uh, yes. Thanks for watching and let us know if you have any questions. Bye. Uh, uh, uh.